That's, That's gay. gay. A phrase you've heard so many times before that at some point it began to feel normal. You figure like all of the other racially inclined sexist innuendos spoken in an overtly homophobic overtone, it's, it's not, not harming anyone. anyone. So you ignore it until that phrase morphs into something more. A question that for some reason scares you half to death. Are, Are you, you gay? gay? It terrifies you so much that the words are you begin a familiar rhythm of anxious heartbeats scattering flapping butterflies down your esophagus and into your stomach where the swirling creatures form a hurricane that picks up subconscious feelings, turns them into conscious fears, and leaves you feeling helpless. What if I am? What does that mean? What can I do? These cyclical feelings that inch you closer and closer to a conclusion feel like they are pushing you further and further from this socially constructed fragile reality that contains your whole life. And in the middle of it is the one secret so deep, so dark, so sharp that surely it would shatter everything. I'm gay. A thought screamed into the rearview mirror of your car, driving as fast as you can, fighting to reconcile the familiarity of your reflection with this new, insurmountable self-identity. I'm gay. A secret only shared with those just close enough that their reactions won't hurt, but not so far that it doesn't matter to you. I'm gay. gay. A phrase slowly building meaning, gaining so much weight that you can no longer hold it in. I'm gay. The words that you choke out, sitting on a bed, standing in a kitchen, typing in a text message, waiting for a response as you shatter your loved one's view of you. I'm, I'm gay. gay. Words that begin to feel more and more true, that sting less and less and push excitement into your throat rather than silencing you with fear. Are, Are you gay? gay? A question no longer needing to be asked because everyone already knows the answer. A question that no longer scares you because you learn to face it head on, quash its ill intent and own its answer. A question that forms on your lips with hopeful glee as you meet someone who just may be like you. <laughs> That's, That's gay. gay. A phrase so common in your voice that it has begun to feel normal as you canonize gay culture in your mind and find that the phrase I'm gay no longer comes with a twinge of fear.